Hi there, YouTubers. Happy New Year. It's Robert Llewellyn here on first day of the new year, 2008. And as you can see, I'm not at home. I'm actually quite high up in the Pyrenees in southern France. Spain is just over that ridge there. Now, I've just been, I've just found out about this. I think it's very apposite, I think is the correct term. Very apposite uh, religion I've just discovered. I haven't converted. But I've just discovered, I'd never heard of it before, and you're, I'm going to mention it, probably all go, oh yeah, we know about that. Cathars, I think that's what they were called, lived in this area in the medieval period, um, 1150 to sort of 1250, in that period. And they were really weird, they weren't, they were Christians, sort of, but they believed that the entire universe, the world, the material world that we inhabit, was made by the devil, and it was made to lure angels onto this level of existence. Uh, and to make them, you know, sin and be um, all those sort of things, and therefore, and, th and the only way they could go back to heaven, th 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 the only way they could achieve angelic bliss was to renounce all worldly possessions and all worldly goods. Quite interesting. So they did. They didn't do a, a year without consuming anything new. They did a whole life. But the other thing they rejected, of course, was the church, paying church taxes, the clergy, the whole idea of the Bible, the cross, of the crucifix. All these things were material things, and therefore. Um, you know, to be avoided and to be shunned. And uh, the Catholic Church, the Roman Catholic Church, looked on these people rather uh, cynically, rather brutally, in fact. In fact, they just slaughtered all of them. And in fact, there was one particular monk who was asked by some soldiers who'd surrounded a Cathar town. They said, how do we tell the Cathars from the Catholics? And the, the monk, a holy man, a man of the cloth, a man of religion, a man of the tolerant Christian religion, said, kill them all, let God sort it out. And that's what they did. 40,000 men, women and children slaughtered in a day. So it was a fairly bloody period of history. Um, but when you're here now, it's gorgeous. And I'm not sure I buy into the whole the devil made the world, because that's... He did a pretty good job around here, if it was true. Um, anyway, so that's it. So there we go, the Pyrenees on New Year's Day. I've got to get right up there to meet the kids and the missus at the cafe. So that's all from me for now. So if you have been, thank you for watching.